Hey, what's going on, guys? Ratnot here again with some more RimWorld Colonial Times. I believe this is our second episode in the first one there. I think everyone got... Looks like everyone... Ooh, a wild woman wanders in. We could try and tame her. Name is Lighter. Um, what's the percentage? 2% chance. Um, we could try and tame her. She's pretty good with animals and things like that. That's about it. We could try and tame her and just see how that goes. <clears throat> uh, let's see. What's Hawk doing? Cutting grass. Infection. Jonathan has infection. That's not good. Infection minor. Who's our doctor? I forget who our doctor is. Jonathan. Seven. Five. So Beth. We'll try and real quick, actually, I'll get Hawk to prioritize this. We could get him to do another one. It's going to be a little tedious, and then we're going to get Beth to actually <clears throat> get Beth to actually go in and perform that on him, so he doesn't die. Hopefully, we can try and beat his infection. Okay, tending, and we'll see how that goes. Fifty percent, not bad, not great, but not bad. Immunity, 5. Infection, 6. Point. Oh, it's going up pretty quick. Um, bed rest. Stay in bed, Jonathan. Very dangerous for you. We can't afford to lose you at this moment. Oh my god, please. Don't feed him that. That's really, really bad. Um, yeah, to be honest, I'm not really sure. <laughs> I'm not really sure exactly what I'm doing. Let's just cook a normal meal. Can't we just cook normal, simple meal? Is that possible? We don't have anything to cook with? Oh, we don't have any food? Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll get it taken care of. Let's harvest some berries. Everyone can be on plant cut, um, which I think that's actually what he's going to do right now. We'll select a bunch of these. Select similar. Um, not really too many of them, are there? Quest available. We'll check that out in a moment. I just want to make sure Jonathan doesn't die. Uh, the immunity's kind of falling behind. For now, we're going to put a little stockpile in here and just... Let's see. Get uh, manufactured, medicine, herbal medicine. We're going to get a stockpile in here and get that going. We really need everyone just kind of... Well, yeah, we could we could do hunting as well. I forgot about that. 2%. Anything that won't kill us. Rats, hares, squirrels, wild boar, lynx. It'd be cool if we could kill some, like a mega sloth or a bison. But we'd need, we'd probably need everyone on it. Otherwise it wouldn't work. Um, should almost be time to harvest some of these. Oh, it is time. Okay, so we have these up here we can harvest, thankfully. Our first, uh, strawberry crop. Uh, these are 60% grown. So we won't harvest those, but we can harvest these, which is exciting. We can cook. Yeah, the last episode there, it was, it was pretty crazy because... Are you hungry? It was pretty crazy we had attacked there at the end and it was pretty tough on us. We we're just falling behind in the immunity. I really hope he doesn't really hope he doesn't die. Um It'd probably help if we <clears throat> got a torch lamp in here at the very least. Who's our cook? I forget. Beth. I don't uh, I don't have our priorities set out yet, but I do need to do that. Uh, Beth, can you just get up? Go go do something. Play some hoopstone and then, you know, take care of everything for us. Um, hunting hair, stone, relaxing socially. Why don't you cook stone? That'd be cool. Jonathan's no longer incapable of walking. Don't do it, Jonathan. Go rest. You need to rest until healed. After you're done with that, build that torch lamp for us. That way we can try and get some better doctoring done. Cook simple meal. I mean, I only had, I only had one of those. Okay, 
We'll get that sorted out. We will get that sorted out. Can you... Why? What do we need? Berries? We need a lot of berries. Yeah, that would be fine. Feed those to Jonathan, I guess. And like, can I just get you... Major break risk, hawk. What's your problem? Intense pain from what? Oh, just everything. Yeah, ravage. Very, very, very hungry. Very hungry. I can't, can't read today. Do me a favor. Why can't you cook? What, what's the problem with the four times simple meals? I know we don't have. Probably don't have enough stuff for it. Um, do until you have eggs. Just get you to do that. Just so we can get something done because. It's really taking forever to get everything going here. We're going to need some more heal root. Uh, we are beating that, thankfully, with the immunity. Try to get that hold urgently. So, something we should really try and think about today is probably where we're going to start putting like our stockpiles and things like that. Um, <clears throat> I do want to kind of do like... Like if we're going to do wood, maybe like a lumber mill here, you know what I mean? Or maybe down by the river, that would be that'd be pretty interesting. We'll go ahead and actually maybe start working on that. A lumber mill. And then, you know, like a stone, like a quarry, like place where they cut the stones, you know, different things. And I just want to, I just want to branch out and stuff and build like a interesting little society. So, I think I'm going to work on getting us some supplies and make sure that Jonathan here doesn't die. So we'll try and get some of these trees and stuff cut and things like that. But we do need to make sure that we have enough food. That's one of our biggest issues. Um, ooh, we could even build like a food pantry, right? I mean, it could be like a... Or even down here by their houses. That would be an interesting little spot for one. And keep like all our, all our food. Kind of maybe pretend that that's like... I don't know. Like a food pantry. It could actually be a food pantry. Um, you know, but that's where everyone goes to get their food. Or, you know, just... I mean, obviously, I think that is exactly what it would be. But, yeah. I don't know. Something like that. Just an idea of a building. I don't know if we'd call it a food pantry. We'd call it anything. Why? Why are you not resting? You need to go rest. You're going to die. Tending expires in 16 hours. I'm assuming someone tended him, and I really hope that they used heal root. Not too sure, though. Just hope he doesn't die. That's the biggest thing. So, Jonathan actually survived his, his infection, so that's good. He's fine, and we're actually beginning to work on kind of like a food pantry. You know, just somewhere they can cook him have food ready and I'm also finally starting on our first bridge um, I did just let the game run for a little bit there and let them just kind of um, kind of get us some wood together I'm gonna build our first bridge going across here um, <clears throat> and then I, I'm going to start de uh, deconstructing this and start kind of building our farms out this way I do now realize that I put all these graves down here, which is fine. I mean, we could just kind of keep a... We could build like a graveyard down here and then have some farms up this way and stuff. Kind of let it branch off. I mean, I think that would be fine. But I, I was thinking, I was like, oh man, I'd like, to, I'd like to put a farm down here for this and blah, blah, blah. And then I was like, oh yeah, I have a bunch of dead people down there. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Crap. I put down the wrong floor down the wrong flooring I am using that one when I need to be using this one so that it matches somewhat at least it doesn't match perfectly but it's better than better than nothing and that's okay and I was trying to tame the uh, lighter and then I realized that um, nobody has the handling skill Hawk is actually he's um, actually training our, our donkey so they can, uh, we can almost ride them, thankfully. Oh my gosh, get out of there, you creatures. Let's see. Clear allowed area, Earth, or area one. I was reading a section where it says Earth spirits. Clear this out, we don't want them running muck in our homes. Really, in any of these buildings. 
priest. Uh, okay. But yeah, and um, I'm going to try and build a probably build a farm down here to start, or maybe up this way, and we'll start growing some hill root and things like that, which we can actually harvest just in case people get infections and stuff. Something we should have thought about, or I should have thought about, and I didn't. Now you know, of course, I'm reaping. Uh, reaping uh, what I sow. Let's see. We can actually do some wooden foundation or uh, yeah, wooden boundaries here. Try to do that with the bridge. Although I kind of want to build like a structure over it so it has a has a roof. Or, uh, yeah, like a structure around it so it has a roof. I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> um, and we'll do some flooring in here as well for wood. I'm going to try and do some stone, probably mostly in our streets. I'm going to have like a street coming down this way and then around the houses, around the buildings we put out this way and whatnot. Uh, and probably mostly, mostly wood inside the actual buildings like these. Um, but yeah, this way, and I do have this pemmican, everyone can actually eat that if they... Or no, no, I'll let them eat these simple meals first. Oh, no, no, no. Hawk, come on, bro. Do normal floor here. And it kind of matches, it's slightly off, but I mean, it's better than nothing. And the idea is kind of to, you know, give it a, give it a bridge look. Probably do a little bit more. Like one more. We should have plenty of wood. I thought we did. Um, I'd say we mostly <laughs> mostly used it up. We'll have to cut some more wood soon anyhow. We'll start cutting some down here as well. Um, we should... Ooh, mana surge. Interesting. Line shifted, causing a surge in mana. All creatures attuned with magical powers will gain mana at an increased rate. Which is Beth. Hide in room, Baskel. All right. File straw. He was insulted. Well, I apologize, Baskel. Who insulted you, my friend? Who done it? Stone and Baskel. Jammer. Cooking with cabbages. What was the... Oh, he doesn't like Hawk. They're rivals. Wow, it's so interesting watching them make make acquaintances. Ooh, Jonathan and Stone may fall in love. That would be interesting. Very interesting, indeed. But yeah, we'll do that, and then probably put some here. Here. We'll use the actual one, two, three, two, three, three. We'll use the actual um, wood walls and stuff for the bridge so that it all, it all kind of matches. Then use this. Oh, I don't have any. Yeah, we'll have to cut more trees. That happens, though. After they get done constructing, all they'll have to do is cut plants anyhow. But I'll actually, I'll wait till that's finished and take them off constructing so they, they do this properly. But we'll actually get a bonfire put in here so they can, they can cook that. Put that right there. Alright. So we actually have a slaver from the Camarar Kin League. So we have, I don't know exactly what they are, I guess they're tribals. Looks like it. It's pretty interesting. Um, we did finish our like food pantry kind of place. Uh, just waiting on some marble blocks to be hauled to our bonfire so we can cook. And we'll get these out of here, these limestone chunks. Bridge is almost complete. Um, let's see, what else happened? We also got a lynx that was self-tamed, so it's pretty interesting. Starting on our first farm down here. And that's pretty much it. Uh... <clears throat> I'm going to see what the slaver wants to trade. Who's our best social? I actually don't know. Social 0, 2, 7. I think, I think it might be Hawk. Nope, it is Baskel, 11. Uh, Hawk got food poisoning. Great. Where's the... Who's the person with the question mark? Like, who do I trade with? I don't see any question marks. Is it is it you? Who who uh who's who's trading? 
Try to arrest. I don't want to arrest anyone, man. I just want to... I just want to trade. <clears throat> Who do I trade with? Is there someone I haven't seen? How do I trade? You? Oh, this is really interesting. They have like a bunch of mismatch armor. It's pretty, pretty cool. Trade with. Oh, oh, oh. I, I would say that said that everywhere. And I'm just not thinking that. You must be like the chieftain. It's awesome. Let's see what they want to trade. Um, they really don't want much. They'll take pemmican, uh, four eyes. Mostly unmodified by gene engineering. I would hope so. Tomboy. I can check your stuff. Incapable of violence. Preferably not. Pretty good. Good constructor. Um, let's see. Oh, I wish they'd let me trade them some stuff. That would be interesting. Maybe if we had a slave. I actually don't think I have enough money. Yeah, pretty cool though. It's worth looking at. Oh yeah, look at this. I think our bridge looks so much better like that. Personal opinion. Uh, we are now riding our donkeys as well. And yeah, we're going to get started on this first farm here, and then we're going to start. I think I have potatoes picked out for this. I want to get a bunch of food ready before winter, and keeping this like pantry, I'm going to build onto this as well, so we can we can put more in there. Our bonfire is almost complete for cooking. Come on. Boom. Perfect. I wonder if I can copy this. Can I copy this? I don't know if it'll allow me to. Yeah, it will. Cool. And we will also copy over Pimmican to not let me paste. That's fine. We'll just manually put that in. Um, where is it? Make pemmican. I thought it was just normal. Okay. Do until you have. Uh, oops. Do until you have. Let's see. We'll do forever if you can. That would be ideal. Um, we will build a copy of this for now and put that in there. Copy. Paste. Deconstruct, deconstruct. And I have a food priority as, I think, what is it? Yeah, important in there. So we should get that all moved in. Um, so I'm going to try and work on this first farm. Not too sure what to work on next after that, but we'll figure it out. Maybe a silo. Maybe we should put a grain silo somewhere. I don't know. We'll figure it out, though. It's finally starting to come together. I was going to use, I think, this as our street marble flagstone. I kind of like it. Kind of have it all coming down from here. It doesn't really line up, though, which is quite unfortunate. So maybe once we come here, have it like that, and then have that. But I am going to... Uh, forbid it all for now until we have time to actually work on it for the moment we shall forbid it um, but yeah that we're just making some progress on the actual town farm things like that I want to make a few of these down through here different farms and stuff and then you know at the um, maybe like at the edges of our cities we'll put some like cannons and stuff we may have to I think we have to research those early cannons yeah We'll try to work on like a little research place as well. Maybe like a, it could be like a little science place or something for us. I think that'd be pretty interesting. Mostly need to deconstruct these runes and whatnot as well. And get those out of here. They do provide quite a bit of resources. Compacted salt. I wish we'd get a better trader. Like a slaver is cool and all. But I want a trader that'll actually, you know, <laughs> accept stuff from us. Like things we can actually sell them. I think that'd be more ideal. And I'm going to put a haul urgently on these to get them out of here. Somebody needs to be on cleaning. Stone. Tell you what. I'll put you on cleaning so we can get everything cleaned. 
tantrum, Beth. That's fine. Throw a tantrum. I couldn't care less. We'll just repair whatever you beat on. She's got her wand out. Gosh. Wouldn't that suck if she like started just blowing things up instead of beating on things? That would be so bad. Oh, great. Thanks, Beth. I prefer this over like an insulting spree or something that will bring other people's moods down. You're vomiting. You're so angry. Just beating on everything, then you just vomit out of pure anger. But yeah, that's pretty much all we've all we've went through so far. Just working on the town some more. No longer having a tantrum. Perfect. So we actually have a bolt goods trader coming through now. We're going to trade with them, and this is the perfect time to show off a little bit of what we've been doing. So I did the, you know, of course, we'll get some tables and stuff set up in here so they can chill out and eat, things like that. Move the storage over to the <clears throat> Hall of Justice, the courthouse, um, which we'll try and work on that soon as well. Hoping to try and expand on it pretty soon. Going to, uh, I'm going to actually build some security up here in the right-hand corner just in case we get raided. We have yet to be raided this episode, and it's... It's kind of scary to be honest. Uh, still working on our farmhouses. We've got our first one here where I'm going to grow um, heel root here and here, and the rest of it's going to actually be hay grass for our animals. Um, we have had we have two donkeys, a lynx, and a wild boar actually uh, joined us here recently. So I think I'm gonna let the boar go with Beth. That way, uh, that way it's not too bad. Um, I don't think it really matters who the master is of the donkeys. Uh, Beth and Hawk are actually in a relationship now as well, so I did make them a double bed. I've gotten everyone in tables in their rooms so far, and I've put a um, lamp in there. Or well, we're still working on the one for stone, but that'll be finished shortly. Um, yeah, everything's going really well this episode, to be honest. I hope that doesn't jinx me for the uh next episode or anything like that but everything honestly is going really well and hawk is actually inspired for a trade but baskel still has a higher a higher trade so who do i trade with here who's the who's the guy you i don't know somebody you okay bolt goods trader they should actually be willing to trade with us like we should be able to sell them some stuff, which would be ideal. Slave, uh, slaver is coming, which is cool. Um, hair meat. Um, ooh yeah, we'll just sell all these drugs because we don't need them. That'll get us a little bit. Camel hide. Sell some pig skin. Uh, we did get a component from that last trader. They left it as a gift, so we'll trade that. Pemmican. I would like to keep my pemmican and my donkeys. We could actually buy buy donkeys from them. They're quite expensive though. Except for these. Let's see. I might buy a donkey from them to be honest. Or we could try and save up a little money and buy some people. Maybe we could sell them some food. We have a lot of potatoes. We could sell the potatoes. Yeah, we'll get quite a bit out of this food. Because we have plenty of corn, right? And uh, we do have quite a bit of pemmican as well for the moment. So we may we may as well just sell that. Hood of Madness. Um, no, no thanks. I think that should be about it. Yeah, and we'll, uh, we'll actually put down a stockpile here. And when the slaver comes through, we'll trade with them. I think I had some silver that was dropped down here. We may have already picked it up, did we? Yeah, we did. So I'm going to leave that there for now, and we'll actually trade with the slaver. We'll probably buy some slaves off them and try and get them into the group. Especially, we do have this unowned place here that uh, we could try and keep a prisoner in. Something's dying. Oh, our lynx is killing boars. Interesting. Thanks, lynx. As soon as the slaver comes down, what it wouldn't be so terrible if these two were not friendly. I hope they're not. I hope they are. I mean, I hope they're friendly. I don't. I really don't want them to fight. That'd be so bad. We'll have to go hide somewhere so we don't die. Baskel, go trade. We'll take some slaves. 
I think slaves are quite expensive. Mm, who do you have? They are pretty expensive. Um, we almost have enough. Who is our guy over here that's trading? There he is. He doesn't really look like the rest of them. Um, let's see. What should we sell him to try and try and get a little more money? Bird skin, light leather. I need that one. Um, plain leather. I need that. We'll sell that in camel hide. Where's the up there? Okay. Now let's go buy a slave. We should have enough money. Put this in our stockpile. So that we have enough. There we go. Whoa. Is that in a stockpile? Oh yeah, it is. Okay. I just need a stockpile so I can buy a slave. Yeah, we have enough. Let's see who's better. Uh, good melee plants. You're a really good grower. Good miner, but we really don't mine much around here. Construction, I mean, yeah. I think we'll take you. Not really good at much much else, to be honest, but you're a good, good grower. That's fine. All right. And you're actually not even a slave. You're just a... Okay, so you're just a person. That's cool. So we can just get you to do whatever we want. Awesome. And we will now... Shrink zones. Get rid of these zones. So now we have an extra person. Lavego. Hello, Lavego. I'm assuming you'll be a great miner. You're not a very good doctor or anything else other than that. Uh, you could cook if you want to, and we'll take Jonathan off cooking. You can also grow and... Uh, should we let you construct? Oh, you're actually, yeah, you're about the same as us on constructing. He fits right in. Perfect. So now we have an extra person. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And these are made out of light leather, so they're kind of kind of funny looking, but... At least we have some security up here. And even if we get attacked from a different side, once they come across the bridge and whatnot, or like if they're coming this way, we'll still be somewhat prepared for it. Because we'll kind of we'll kind of be ready for it, I suppose. How much of this do we have left? Oh, we have plenty of that left. Really doesn't use up much on these, does it? We could even do this. Just try and protect it. And then once we, you know, we could always deconstruct it later on, things like that, and move it outward, but for the moment it's it's pretty good. I'm frozen. Quest available. The gentle yaks. Duchess making a request. She wants you to take care of yaks. Yaks are her favorite pets and she wants them to. Refugee Empire. I didn't think we had any um I didn't think we had any Empire factions on this. As far as I know. We shouldn't. Factions. Where's factions? Factions. Oh, there is one. Where are you? You shouldn't be on here. Or does it just say that? Yeah, I think it just... Oh, no, there is a small one. Where did you come from? Where did this come from? Because I don't think it was here originally. Um, maybe I'll have to delete it. I don't know off camera and take care of it. But yeah, it, uh, it definitely shouldn't be here because I did not create it. Uh, we'll take care of it. Though I could always just delete it off screen or something. No worries. I don't really think they'll have much contact with us. Maybe they just kind of spawn... Maybe I made a misclick somewhere. Yeah, factions. Because I, I think they're like... Shattered Empire. Maybe that's why. Maybe it's a Shattered Empire. I'm not really sure. Because I don't think it was there originally. We only had the tribes and these. I don't really think they'll associate with us or, you know, do anything like that. But you never know. Quests. 
You see Glitter World, Medicine, Uranium. No, we don't want that. Get out of here. We're not doing quests for that. If it becomes an issue, I will delete that faction. I think they spawned in on their own. But, yeah, I don't really see it being an issue. I doubt that they'll, they'll come through or anything. But just in case, you know, I could always try and delete them. I'm assuming maybe they just kind of pop up on their own where it's a Shattered Empire. We'll pretend that they're not there. If it does become an issue, I'll, I'll get rid of them. Um, but yeah, no worries, no worries. We're starting our farms. We'll probably get these farms going as well, or this farm going, I mean, as well. Uh, everything looks pretty good, to be honest. I'm going to try and probably work on our lumber mill, probably here. I think this would be a good area. We could do that on camera as well, actually, because I haven't really been building on camera very much. Kind of like right up against the water, I guess. Maybe kind of bring it this way. And then something like this, kind of more square. I don't know. I don't want my shapes to be like perfectly square, right? I want them to, I want them to look kind of different. So, and then we could try and do. Um, hmm. Probably bring this out this way. Or should I do it out here? Like, right there, and then here, here, and here, right? And so what we'll do, build a roof area. Do you know how, like, at lumber yards, you know, if, you, if you've ever been to a lumber yard, they kind of keep their wood outside and stuff, like underneath some shelter? That's what we'll do here. So we'll go ahead and work on that and get that going. Don't really know what we'll put inside, but we'll put something in there. Something pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, that's it so far, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this episode. I know there hasn't been too much really done. No raids or anything. We've mostly just been building. But I do hope you've enjoyed. And yeah, stay tuned for the next one if you have. We'll be sure to make a few more and whatnot. And a few more episodes and have some fun with it. And we'll probably, probably try to get our stone cutting up and running next episode. And move this somewhere useful. Um, I've noticed that a good majority of this is marble, I think, so we'll try and try and mostly build our streets and whatnot out of that, and we may try and get our stone cutter up and going. Probably like try and build that down here, maybe start building our roads, things like that. Actually, I may go ahead and may go ahead and do that. I forget where I was going to do that at though. This will take a really long time to to actually build. So let's see. We'll go ahead and bring that up this way. Kind of connect those up. I'd like to kind of do maybe like a sidewalk as well. I think that'd be, I think that'd be pretty cool. But yeah, guys, if you have uh, enjoyed this one, be sure to stay tuned for the next one. I'll see you, see you then. Goodbye.